Are you a content creator? Do you have a YouTube channel? Want to monetize, promote, and protect your channel from intellectual property theft? At a forever, we will monetize, optimize, and protect your channel, helping you earn better. We also offer you professional content management support guidance. Join our network today and enjoy our premium benefits. Contact us at mcnataforever.com. Love you, you love me. We are the end and you don't you you say you love me too. I love you so much, my friends. for this baby. So I just don't want anyhow entrance. I need a grand entrance for my baby. So I want us to go address the guest first. Whatever. Let's go. Let's go. Going to wear it until you grow into it. Nse, <laughs> okay, let's honey. Nse, nse. Ma, stay with the baby, okay? Okay, come on. Okay, just don't wake him up, okay? Stay with it. I never seen you stand up before. Before. He has blessed us today. Hey. We are here to celebrate. We are here to jubilate. Hey. God has blessed us today. Super. That's why we are here to sing. Wonder, wonder, wonder. Hey. This God do 
And in those years, I got married to my sunshine, as I call her. And God blessed us with two beautiful golden daughters who own my heart. I love them. But something was missing. And finally, God answered us by giving us a son through one of my daughters. My grandson, Calvin. I named him Obinaya, which means the heart of his father. The boy that would one day inherit my entire empire. Let me stop here and allow my son in law, Richard. Thank you all for coming. Thank you so much. Uh, I really appreciate your presence. My father in law has said it all. For the people who know me very well, you all know I'm a, I'm a man of very few words. But believe me, I am really happy. God has finally answered us. Uh, but I believe my wife is actually in a better position to uh, say it exactly how we feel. So I'll hand over to my wife. First of all, I want to thank you all for coming here today. You know, I, I really can't believe that you all are here for me, for us. It, it, it was a terrible experience to live without a child. I mean, for seven good years, for seven good years, it, it was a terror to live through. But we're here today. Because of me, we have a son, we have a boy that we all love so much. Calvin. 
So I, I just, I thank God for, you know, putting smile on my face again. I mean, lots of people called me barren. It got to a point I lost faith. I mean, I never believe I will be called a mother. And God blessed me with a faithful husband, with the best man in the world, who stood by me all through these years. I'm sorry, I'm tearing up. I just have to say all this because it's still a surprise for me. Like, we're here today because of me. I'm a mom. <laughs> thank you all. Thank you all so much for coming. All right, thank you very much. Uh, I believe you all want to see the boy, right? Want to see the baby, right? Uh, okay, okay, fine. So, uh, he's a very handsome, beautiful boy, actually. Uh, just like his father. Nse! Nse! Where is Kelvin? Kelvin is... Madam, I don't understand you. Understand what? I left Kelvin here to go make his food. Okay, if you left him here, I'll bring him now. My guests are waiting. Madam, I left him here. Where did you take him? What? Are you mad? Are you stupid? Let me, let, me, let me just go and ask. Let me go and ask.
Good day, madam. Inspector Sam from Post Headquarters and uh, I'm with Inspector Jude. Accept my sincere sympathy. Don't worry, we'll get to the root of this. My men are already in the compound, uh, searching everywhere thoroughly and questioning all the guests. If you don't mind, I have a couple of questions to ask you. Uh, when exactly did you realize uh, the baby was missing? Immediately we went upstairs to get the baby so that we can present him to the guests. My sister realized that the big bed was empty. He was gone. Just like that. Just like that. <laughs> was the baby left alone in the room? Of course not. He was left with the nanny. Yes, sir. Who is the nanny? The baby was left in your car. Is that correct? Yes, officer. Where's the baby? He was on the bed when I left. For the kitchen to get hot water for the baby's food. On returning, I I found Madame without the baby. Did you notice any strange movements before then? Any visitor coming into the house before that time? It was just baby Kelvin and I. No one else. Say you're lying. Say you're a liar, sir. Are you lying? Give me my son, sir. Sir, let's go, sir. I said, you know. Thank you, sir. If you don't mind, can we take a look around your house? Who will take me around? What's the sir? I'm going with you. Did you notice any strange movement from the guests? Any movement that is not usual? I mean, anything at all suspicious? Is there anybody you think that can do a thing like this? Your enemies or business associates? Chief? I am a successful businessman. I am bound to have enemies, even those that I know not. Have. But I do not think that any of them would have the guts to help my family. Madam, Mr. Richard. And so come with us to the station for further questioning. Okay, okay, so come on, let's no, go. No, 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 no. No, 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 I have to My be love, there. No, 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 this trust me too much. I will go. This might be a kidnap case. Yes. So you stay close to your phone. If it is, they will try to contact you. And you too, Mr. Richard. Take her. Yes. Yes, my baby. Who is my baby? Hey! <laughs> 
What I need is the truth, and nothing but the truth. I swear to you, officer. I don't know anything about it. It's a very rant. But you were the last person she saw before leaving the room. And she left that baby in your care. I swear to you, officer. Oh, my mother screamed. I did not do it. I don't know what happened to the child. I I went to make food for Kelvin. That was the last time I saw him. I don't know what happened to the child. Believe me, officer. My uncle and mother were the kindest people. On the face of this earth, <laughs> yesterday, made it exactly four years that they saved me from an accident. Why would I steal a child when I know how much he means to them? Sir, sir, sir. Just listen to me. Begin here. You've known my wife and I for many years. You've lived with us for many years, right? You know how long we tried to have a child. Finally, Kelvin came. My son. My beloved son. Begin here. Please. Anything you want, just say. Any amount of money you want, let me know. I'll give it to you, okay? I'll give you the money. I'll end the case. Just give me my child. I'm begging you. Give me my child, please. Please. Sir, I'm innocent. I don't know. Please, officer. Believe me, I don't know. I mean, no sense.
Please, please come here. Please, I'm sorry. Please talk to me now. Where the police able to? Where the police able to get our son's location? I can't find my grandson. Huh? Can you see? Nothing. It's a maintain that she knows nothing about her. No news. Is that all? Just that. What are you saying? What are you saying? That our son is... That Kelvin is... Is gone? That Kelvin is... No. No. Mm -mm. No. 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 That, that cannot be true. No, no, no. This isn't happening. This this isn't happening. This isn't happening. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. This cannot be happening. This isn't happening. Tell me, praise the Lord is with thee. Blessed are they amongst men, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Mary, Mother of God, Mary, Mother of children, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are they amongst men, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Mary, Mother of God, 
is Any information for me, please? No. Nothing helps us do nothing. We love you, baby. Jesus. Jesus. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Jesus. Baby, we have to get to the police what? station immediately. We have to get to the police station. Oh, fine, 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 fine. So this is a kidnap case. It means that your baby is still alive. It also means that they will contact you soon to make that Okay. Once they do, we track the number. Don't worry, your baby will be found. What about him, sir? Oh, Nani, has she said anything? Yes, that's what she said. Nothing useful, nothing. She's still insisting that she's innocent. This has not said anything. Nothing, she's not. Hey.
Yes, yes. Jesus. That means they're here. Yes. They're here somewhere. Yes. Wait, wait. No, baby, wake up. What? Oh, no, no, please. These guys are here somewhere. No, 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 no. Huh? We're safer inside here, please. Please, we're in the police station, please. Don't try to go out there. Who's this? Wait, 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 don't, don't move, don't move. Wait. Where are they now? That means they are here. I mean, they know we're in the police station, that means they are around. Look around. Just don't move, wait. He's with him. He's with him. Wait. wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Yes, yes. Wait, stay with me, stay with me. What do we do? Your father. My, my father. My father knows about them. Are you going to kill us? You want them to kill our son? People are looking at us. We can't go in there anymore. Please, let me just call my dad, please. Let me call my father. The number is not connected. Try again. Good. You said your father knows about him. Dad! My father is still not connected. Don't see that. I just got off the phone with the Inspector General of Police. Mm -hmm. Concerning the kidnap of my grandson, Obi Naya. And he said that they are making progress. But... Father, what do you know about the disappearance of my son? Excuse me. Father, you heard me. The kidnapper said that you know about them. So I ask again, what do you know about the disappearance of my son? Know about them. What are you talking about? What is going on here? Mother, they said your husband knows about the disappearance of my son, that he knows them, the kidnappers. This is the next thing. What? Edmund, what have you got to do with this? Are you both drunk? How can you accuse me of kidnapping my own grandson? To what gain? I ask, to what gain? Father, what is Project G15? The G15 is an organization set up by the government to take care of terrorism and money laundering. But the organization folded 30 years ago. I wonder what this has to do with the kidnap of my grandson. Is, is that it? Is this the only explanation?
Father, who is Chief Mosu? Father, why are you keeping quiet? Why are you silent? Please say something. Who is Chief Mosu? What do you have to do with all of this? Where is my son? Where is my son, Father? Who is Chief Mosu? Chief, what is going on? Who is Chief Mosu? Edmond, where is my grandson? Father. Oh, Father, you're not saying anything. Say something, please. Inspector Sam, I need you to question my father. He knows about the disappearance of your son. Is this? I believe my father knows about my missing child. Chief, what do you know about the missing child? Project G15, what is it all about? I was contracted to supply weapons for the project, which I did, nothing more. Who is Chief Musu? He was a friend of mine. He worked with me on the project. He died many years ago. And what has Chief Wosu and Project G15 got to do with the missing baby? Why don't you ask the kidnappers? I am sure their number is on the phone, if you're not blind. For God's sake, we are talking about my grandson here. How can you all be insinuating that I kidnapped my own grandson? A son I never had. A son who would one day inherit all that I have worked for. A boy that I love more than my own life. Tell me. Tell me, Inspector. Just tell me.
I got a call from Linda, my friend. So she said there's a private investigator that she hired. And the guy is so good with kidnap cases and all that. Okay. And he wants to see me now, so I have to go to her house. Oh, fine, L let's go. No, 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 please. I don't want you to go with me. I need you here. I need you to, to, to keep an eye on my father. Please. I have to go at this alone. It's good. Where is our son? Where is our son? Baby. Baby, please. I need you to be strong for me. Please, you can't afford to break down now. Okay. We're going to find our son. Okay? It's good. Please. please. It's all right. We're going to find our son, okay? Okay? I have to go. I love you. Give me the key. Be careful. Huh? I will be. be careful. Will be. Drive carefully. Yes. Anything that happens, call me. I will. Huh? Everything will be fine, okay? Come on. This is him. Yeah, this is Mr. Robinson, the private time investigator I told you about. Okay. He's worked on several kidnap cases. He's one of the best. Mr. Robinson, this is Tracy, my best friend, the mother of the kidnapped child. I'm so sorry about what happened. Just find my son, please. Just find my son, please. Just find my soul, please. Just find my boy. Um, first, I would like you to answer a few questions for me. Look, Mr. Robinson, I left my baby with my nanny, went outside to attend to my guest, only for me to come in and my baby was nowhere to be found. I couldn't find my son anywhere in the house. You get? And now my nanny is insisting that she knows nothing about it. She's being interrogated at the police station right now. And during the event, I didn't notice any strange movement. Nothing like that. Nothing. Have they contacted you? Yes, they have. They sent me a few messages. Here. They implicated your father? Yes. Yes, they did. He's being questioned right now. Let me take the number. I will track the number. Okay. Have they made any demands? No, they have not. They will still come to that part. They always do. They will know what they really want. Oh. <laughs> Take this phone, it will help me.
That was all for now. Just, just that. So, when are you bringing my son? How are we? How would you now bring him to me? What, what, what's going to happen now? I have your number. I will contact you. Your child will be found. Madam. That I don't want somebody. This is my crime. It's okay. Hello? We warned you. Who the hell? Who the hell ghost are you people? Who the hell are you people? And what have I ever done to you people? What have I ever done to you to deserve all this? Huh? What have I ever done to you people? Whatever it is you have with my father, how does he concern my six months old baby? Six months old. This boy is just six months. How does he concern? What have I done to please? Just hello, hello. Oh my God, they are dumb. Oh shit! I'm out of air time. Please, can I can I have your phone? Thank you. Nine zero three seven nine five eight seven. I think there has to be some sort of mistake. Seven, seven. Linda, you? You said the number belongs to a guy you dated four years ago, right? Yes. And that his name is Murphy? Yes. You also said that since you broke your heart years back, you guys parted ways. When was the picture taken? Four years ago. I swear, since then, I've not seen one of you. We have overwhelming evidence against you, and he could land you in prison for years. Many years. The only way out is for you to lead us to Murphy. Where does he stay? Number six, Moano Street, Independence Layout.
Jackson. Do you live around this neighborhood? Yeah, stay here. This is number six Marlow Street, right? Yes, sir. This is six and I stay in eight. Okay, you stay in eight? Yes, sir. Do you know anybody by name Murphy Edoche? I don't really know. The owners of the house packed out three years ago. It was demolished and this building is the new building and has been abandoned for two years. Oh, really? Okay. You can go. Thank you very much. Why can't you talk to that resident four years ago? Where is he now? Where is he? I don't know. The only address I get to is the one I know about. Linda, give me my son now, Linda. Give me my baby boy. Where is our son? Where is our son? What do you know about this? Where is our son? I don't have a son. I don't know what my dad is. I have to believe me. Sir, this just came in from first headquarters, Abuja. Take a look. Murphy is a member of a dreaded criminal group led by the White Eagle. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Huh? For over 10 years, they led the deadliest criminal attacks in the history of this country. Yes. Kidnapping, robbery, all sorts. They terrorized practically all the states in Nigeria without being caught. There were always many steps ahead of the police. We are ahead of them. We are ahead of them. Hey, God. We later got the identity of one of the gang members, Murphy, their boyfriend. A few years ago, they disappeared. Till this minute, nothing has been heard about them. This simply means that the white eagle is back and he has your son.
God, why? Why me? I asked you for a son and you gave me one. And then you took him from me. Why? Why? I'm really, really very sorry, sir. Tracy, I'm so sorry. I understand how much you love your son, but try as much as you can to put yourself together. Please. Richard, put yourself together. Sorry, okay? Please. I want my son's cops. They've killed my boy. They've killed my son. Please let me bury my boy. I want to see my son's body.
Hello. Your Excellency. His Excellency, the Deputy Governor, wants to see me concern this issue. It's okay. God knows best. Be strong. Richard. Be strong. Take heart. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Now I need to rush back to the hospital right now. Please, be yourself again. Jesus! What? Oh my God! Her son is alive. Oh my God! Oh my God! My baby is alive. Is alive. Oh Jesus! Thank you, Jesus! Thank you, Jesus! Thank you, Jesus! Hey, Kelvin is alive. Kelvin is alive. Kelvin is alive. Thank you, Jesus! Kelvin is alive. So sad. Thank you, Jesus! Thank you, Jesus! We have to go through this kind of pain. It's too much. This cup is too much for us to bear. Why? 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 Did you see the blood on our son's face? Huh? He's just a baby. He's just a baby. Six months old. He had blood. He had blood on his face. Huh? He had blood. He had blood on his face. Our six months old son had blood. Kelvin had blood on his face. He had blood on your face. Husband is just having a minor heart attack. Yeah, okay, be fine. just calm down. Heart attack. Yes. Be fine. You'll be fine. Yeah, you'll be fine. Oh. Baby, doctor, what are we?
we going to do? I'll prescribe some drugs for him. The drugs will stabilize him. Okay. No, 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 please, I'm buying it. Please, you can't see me. Oh. Madam, I would have to be back, but I have an emergency. I need to rush back to the hospital. Once I get to the hospital, I will send a nurse and I will look after him. Any further development, just give me a call. Oh, oh Lord. Never you are a liar. Never you are a loser. Nothing will happen to my family. Nothing will happen to my son in law. Three one eight five six zero five. Mom, mom, has to be reset. Three one eight five six zero five nine. I said I had you, and I wouldn't want. Any disappointment this time around? Stone, no disappointment, okay? Stone, I said no disappointment this time around. Help me, mother. Mother, where is my son? Excuse me. You heard me. Where is Kelvin, mother? What are you talking about? No, don't you dare lie to me. Did you hear me? Don't you dare lie to me. So you are the white ego. White ego? What the? Mother, I'm going to show you what has come about. If you do not provide my son right this minute, Mother, I am going to break you into pieces. Do you hear me? I'm going to break you into pieces. Where is my son? What is going on? What? Dad, I should be asking you and mom what is going on. I should be asking both of you what is going on here. I ran into one of the kidnappers today. 
and I found Monk's number in his pocket. Just before he was killed by a car. I know absolutely nothing about this. I swear. Maybe they were planning to contact me to make further demands. Mother, you lie. Who is Stone? I overheard you speaking to him on the phone. Stone? Yes, Mother, who is Stone? Stone is my mechanic. And I was just trying to Mother, tell you. you lie. You lie. Stone does not sound like the name of a mechanic. It sounds like the name of a criminal. But Mother, why? Why? How can you, Mother? What have I ever done to you? What? What is wrong with you, Tracy? I will not have you accuse me falsely. What the heck is wrong with you? I'm going to tell you what is wrong with me, Mother. I'm going to tell both of you what is wrong with me. If you do not provide my son, Kelvin, if you do not provide Kelvin this night, somebody is going to die in this house. Somebody is going to die here today, Mother. Provide my son, Dad. Where is Kelvin? Why are you shouting a woman down like that? Abigail, what are you doing here? What are you doing here? I left you in the house to look after my husband. What are you doing here? The nurse has arrived and she's taking care of your husband. I just got a call that my fiancé had an accident. They said Murphy is dying. He's dying. What? What did you just say? Murphy? Who is Murphy? Murphy is my fiancé. You've not met him. Dad, remember you met him once. They said he had an accident today. And he's dying. Sister, please, can I go and see him? He needs me. He needs us. You listen to me. You listen to me. Because it is very, very obvious that the three of you are listening together. But did you see today? If you do not provide my son, Father, if you do not provide my son, somebody is going to die here today, I swear to God. Mother, somebody is going to die here today, I will not take it. So you are in this. So you are in this together, Abigail. Oh my God. Somebody is going to die here today. Stop. Stop. I said somebody is going to die here today. Please do not provide my son. Just come over here. Mother, just shut up. Just shut up. Sister, please stop. Please oh, shut up, my friend. And you shut up too. What has come over you, Tracy? We are your family for Christ's sake. You accuse me of kidnapping my grandson. And then your mother. And now your sister. Tracy, are you mad? Father, yes, I've gone mad. Father, I have um, I have gone here. The one who sent to you, I'm going nuts. Who's my son, Father? Where's my son? Give me my son. Give me Calvin. Give me my son, Father. Give me my son. Stop. Give me my son. Let's come over and stop. Please calm down. Please. Murphy was hit right before me today. Right before me, Murphy was hit by a car. And he died right in front of me. And I got Mom's number from his pocket. And that same Murphy is your fiancée, Abigail. Wait. They said Murphy's accident happened in Abuja. Are you drunk? Did you not hear what I just said? I said Murphy got hit by a car in front of me in New Haven today. You're talking nonsense. The hospital that he was admitted in said the accident happened in Abuja, not New Haven. See, it couldn't have been the same Murphy. Slow down. We are all in this together. You mean that? Okay? You're going to break down if you don't take time. You need to work together with us for your husband. Oh. oh my God. Richard. Richard. File 434 is a file that contains all the information that the G15 carried out on behalf of the government. It had to do with money laundering 30 years ago. 
G15 was later folded and buried. My good friend Chief Ruben headed the project with me. He died many years ago because of the sensitive nature of the file. Anyone who lays his hand on it becomes a billionaire. Because the government wants to reopen the case and many people on the list will pay anything to have the file or have their names wiped off the file. Okay, so where is the file? Where is the file now? I don't is not here. Then it is gone. That is not gone though. Abigail, look, it's still here. Leave your mom gone, gone. Oh great, gone. Oh, gone. This cannot be it, oh daddy. This cannot be it, dad. This cannot be it. It's not in here, dad. Hey. Hey. Without this farm, my son is dead. So we must take care of him. <laughs> Thank you. 
15 minutes left. No, my it's not connected.
never wondered why you never met any member of my family. Not even one. years ago, I led the deadliest criminal group in the history of this country. We coordinated attacks in the 36 states. We never failed. Not even once. Do you know how intelligent you need to be to coordinate such attacks? In the span of 10 years without recording a single failure. Do you? At the mention of my name, the entire country trembled with fear. But I was known as White Eagle. Yes. The White Eagle. My family knew too much about me. They wanted to sell me out. My two brothers, my two sisters, my parents. So I killed them. Then I met you. You wanted a good man. I had to become I give up my successful enterprise just to give you what you wanted. Just to love you. I give you everything. And what did I get in return? You humiliated me. You made a mockery of my love. you to help me retrieve a certain classified file from your father-in-law. My name is Chief Ruben. A certain man named Drogo led me to you. He said that you can do what I Your father-in-law was my business partner 30 years ago. But he betrayed me. Then I disappeared. He thought I was dead. But I've come back to take what rightfully belongs to me. I need that file. 
I know your father-in-law very well. He is a very stubborn man. Getting him to release that file will not be easy at all. I guess that's why Drogo said, if anyone can get that file from him, that man is you. If you are interested in the deal, I will give you all the details once we are in agreement. Then you are prized. I accepted the proposal just to punish you and your family. Now you know why we Give him the file. Pays me. I kill you. I kill your bastard son. Then I run away. Broken moderator. I waited for 30 whole years for this file. My money.
No. No, Tracy. Don't do it. You're not a murderer. You're not like him. He is a murderer. Please don't be like him. Tracy, please. I beg you. Chance miraculously produced care of it. 